All right, the circumference of a sphere is 56 pi. We're supposed to find the surface area. Um, well, let's start with what we're given, the circumference. Anytime they give you something like that, it's usually a good idea to start by writing down the formula for it. So we're given the circumference. Circumference is um, 2 pi r. Or you could write pi d. Some kids are more comfortable with pi d which is will work out fine as well. Um, I usually use 2 pi r. Okay, so the circumference is 2 pi r. Um, we are given 56 pi for that circumference. So I can take that 56 pi and substitute it in uh, for c. Make sure you write the pi. Some kids just put 56 by accident and they forget the pi. So if you're getting the wrong answer, you might have forgotten the pi, so be careful. So this will be 56 pi equals 2 pi r. All right, what am I going to do now? Sure, um, we might as well solve, solve for r by dividing both sides by 2 pi. That gives me that the radius is 28. Now, let's see, we're supposed to find the surface area though. So, we need to take that radius and use it to find the surface area. Well, surface area formula is 4 pi r squared. Okay, so using the radius of 28, and substituting that in, that's going to give me that the surface area is 4 pi times 28 squared. which gives me 3,136 pi or uh, as a decimal that would be 9,852.03 and that is, uh, see we're doing area so that's square centimeters okay that is how you do number 11.